Welcome back. A well-known security guard is fighting for his life at this hour after being shot last night at a Northwest Miami-Dade Metro rail station. As CBS 4's Peter Dench first reported at noon, that guard was a veteran who was injured previously in Desert Storm. Peter has been working the story and has the very latest from Jackson Memorial Hospital. I think they're idiots, the two guys that shot him. I really do. Metro Rail passenger Rativa Woods is outraged at 49-year-old Keith Cox, the security guard who worked the night shift at the Dr. Martin Luther King Metro Rail station, was shot Tuesday night. Well, I think it's a, a travesty, a real travesty, because these guys, they come here, they work hard, they should be able to protect and serve us while doing their job. Police say it happened around 9.30 at the station at Northwest 27th Avenue and 62nd Street. Shots were fired and police were called after Cox was found lying on the ground near these Metro Rail surveillance cameras. I don't like that, you know what I mean? I don't, that, that's not cool. Treha Woods is especially upset. Cox recently helped his wife, Rativa, after she fell from her wheelchair. He a good guy, he a good officer, you know what I mean? But he helped me out the other day when she fell out of her chair. He came and assisted me in that situation. Very, very tragic situation. We're very sorry uh, to Officer Cox and, and all of his family. Cox was an eight-year Air Force veteran who was injured in Desert Storm and who had worked at 50 state security since 2011. These guys are special guys. Uh, they're, they're in a very, very difficult situation. They perform incredibly well. Uh, we're very proud to have them out there. Uh, they have extensive training, and that training has served us well and served them well. And this is one of those things that you just can't uh, predict, uh, and you're devastated when it happens. So far, police say they do not have a motive for the shooting of this security guard. If you know anything regarding what happened here last night, please come forward and let someone know. Miami-Dade police tell us they are looking at surveillance tape from the Metro Rail station and may be able to release some images. They say they're looking for two men who took off in a dark-colored vehicle. If you can help them with this case, call Miami-Dade Crime Stoppers at 305-471-TIPS. At Jackson Memorial Hospital, Peter Danch, CBS 4 News.